Hello everyone, I'm Damien, I'm from the University of Mons in Belgium, and I'm here to talk to you about package freshness in Linux distributions. So Linux comes in a wide variety of distributions, and these distributions don't all make the same choices when it comes to certain aspects of the packages they choose to include. Some distributions put great emphasis on stability. Others are adamant on having the most secure system possible. And finally, some distributions want to deliver new versions of packages to their users as quickly as possible. The notions of stability and security have been extensively studied. On the other hand, the notion of freshness has not. We are therefore tackling it through a mixed study. This mixed study is composed of a survey, about which I'm going to report today, and empirical analyses that we are conducting. The survey had both academic and participants from the industry. We got 170 participants, and we really wanted to know what the perception was of the freshness of the packages in their most used distribution. We also wanted to know if they valued having fresh packages in their distributions, and why and how they update packages. We first asked them what distributions they use. Unsurprisingly, Ubuntu, Debian, Red Hat, Arch, and OpenSUSE dominate. For the rest of the questions, we divided packages into six categories. Open source and user software, proprietary end user software, development tools, system tools and libraries, programming language libraries, and programming language runtimes. Then we ask users what is their perception of the time it takes for package updates to reach the official repositories of their most used distribution. For rolling releases like Arch Linux and OpenSUSE Tumbleweed, it was perceived to be very quick on the other days. For distributions that favor Stability, on the other hand, it was perceived to take months. And then there was a spectrum of answers in between those. We asked them how important it is to them to have uh, fresh packages, and they, for the most part, value it quite a bit. Finally, we asked them how they update packages. And we considered five possible update mechanisms, using the official repositories of the distribution, using community repositories, using third-party package managers, installing from pre-compiled uh, binaries, or installing manually from sources. Installing through official repositories dominates clearly. It is the first choice of the users. Then comes community repositories, and as far as proprietary software is concerned, sometimes it's not in the official repositories, so they have to install from binaries. Finally, for programming language libraries, there's quite a bit of use of third-party package managers, which makes sense, right? This is a preliminary empirical analysis. We looked at snapshots for the five distributions on the screen, snapshots from around October 2019, and we wanted to know what proportion of packages in a source distributions were at least as up-to-date as those in a target distribution. We see a great variety between these distributions. For instance, CentOS only has 28% of packages that are at least as up-to-date as Arch Linux. So, in conclusion, we found that users value having fresh packages in the distributions they use for reasons of security or to obtain bug fixes and new features. We found that they will update to official repositories whenever it is possible, and that their perception of the speed at which packages are deployed within a distribution vary greatly by distribution. Quantitatively, we established that there is a continuum of distributions with regards to package freshness and that there is a large disparity between these distributions. If we consider that only 28% of CentOS packages are up-to-date with Arch, and as many as 72 are up-to-date in Fedora compared to Arch. Further analyses are required to compare whether the perception of users really is accurate and to quantify the differences between distributions, as well as to establish whether and how big is the link between stability and freshness. Is there a trade-off between them? So if you have any questions, 